Hi everyone, my name is Rag Diamond and welcome to my course titled ASP.NET Core Health Checks. I've been developing and architecting software at a commercial level for well over 15 years. Along this time I've seen various ways of monitoring and reporting that your .NET based applications are alive and healthy. And over the years I've seen everything from pointless pinging of servers to hollow API endpoints that don't tell you much in terms of how healthy your application and its dependencies really are. For example, your application might be physically working okay, but its connection to a database or an API that it relies on might be long gone. And in this type of situation, relying on primitive types of health checks won't tell you what your customer is actually experiencing. And if you're always a step behind your application issues, where your customers know before you know, your customers will also eventually be long gone. The good news is, since .NET Core 2.2, there's now a native ASP.NET Core health checks framework that will give you the ability to create all the health checks you need to confirm your software and its dependencies are fully working 100% all the time. This course teaches you ASP.NET Core health checks using real life scenarios so that you can proactively monitor your software and its dependencies for failures and issues and at the same time giving you the ability to protect your reputation, your business and your customers. So by the end of this course, you'll be fully skilled up in implementing ASP.NET Core health checks in your ASP.NET Core applications. And before you begin this course, you should be familiar with .NET Core software development and c -sharp programming. So I hope you'll join me on this journey to learn ASP.NET Core health checks with this course at Pluralsight.